Jeff Seiler Interactive Display Systems and I'm here in my garage uh, unveiling to the world the car kiosk. I'm very proud and happy to be able to uh, unveil this. We got to get a new graphic put on because the first one wasn't quite where it needed to be. But anyway, this is my Ford Expedition and I've got a 24 inch touchscreen mounted on the side window. The monitor is a bright one like you'd see out of the gas pump kiosk and I've got my laptop connected to it and I have enabled this glass to be interactive. So imagine you're on the job site, you're wanting to show, let's say you're a realtor and you want to show houses or you want, you're on the job, a construction site, and you want to pull up blueprints. What's your options normally? You got a laptop, you got your phone, life's terrific. Oops, it starts raining, that's a bad thing. Oops, you dropped your phone and you didn't have a protector on it and the screen gets cracked or whatever. You're pretty well dead in the water. Great thing about it, I can't drop my vehicle. I don't care if it gets wet and I'm not going to melt so it's not a problem. But imagine having your vehicle enabled so that you can just pull up websites on one of the windows, do what you do all of the time, right from your vehicle, have all of the responsiveness that you have with your touchscreen, laptops, iPads, phones, that sort of thing, but doing it from your vehicle and being able to pull up all kinds of information that you can interact with my signal's a little poor here because I'm in the garage with my phone being a hot spot. If I was outdoors where I could get good reception, then things would be a lot better. But here I am interacting with websites from my vehicle. I mean, if I pulled up another browser tab and notice, just like you're used to, I clicked in the field where I can type and away we go. And I googled car kiosk. Guess what you get? You get kiosk with car information on it. <coughs> but I'm doing this from my vehicle window. In the rain, in the sun, it doesn't matter. I brought it in the garage because it was so bright outside that it was kind of glary and you can't see the video when it's glary. But I can see the screen fine to work on it. So... You have the ability to do whatever you're doing from the vehicle, and I can, if my work involves gloves, I can do this if I've got gloves on. It doesn't care. It doesn't matter. I can interact with the screen with gloves on, without gloves, rain, shine, it doesn't matter. I can do what I do anywhere from my vehicle window <clears throat> and be able to do my work wherever if i'm wanting to show houses if i'm wanting to pull up blueprints if i'm a first responder it doesn't matter i can pull up the information i need right where i'm at and interact with screens all day long oh what the hey you know, here again is our website. I can pull up anything. I could read my email here out in the field. It don't matter. In fact, I was doing that earlier just for the fun of it. Gmail. Because I had already logged in to this system. Look at that. I'm looking at my email out on the side of my vehicle wherever I want to. The car kiosk, we can do this for you on your vehicles. Jeff Seiler, Interactive Display Systems.